Hey guys and welcome back to another new Animal Crossing video. I'm Crossing Channel and today I'm going to be ranking all of the different fruits in Animal Crossing. Now this is actually a request I got a few times, believe it or not. I got it on my live streams, people really wanted me to rank all the different fruits. So I've decided to do it and we're going to get straight into this. It's just a bit of fun pretty much, just a nice little fun idea to rank all of the different fruits. And here we have our traditional tier list. So let's get into this. First of all we have the apple. The apple is a very iconic and classic fruit. It's not my favorite. I think it belongs in the A tier. It's a very, very good fruit. Definitely deserves a high ranking. You know, it's iconic, but not quite S tier material. The orange. Now the orange is a fruit that I actually really enjoy in real life eating. Same with apples to be fair, though I'm more of a fan of green apples. But I think it's gonna have to go in the A tier along with, with apples. It's not quite my favorite and I don't think it really belongs in the S tier. So a very strong ranking to have, I have to remember that. Peaches, very, very popular with Animal Crossing fans. Not my favorite though, honestly, to be real with you guys, not my favorite. I think I'm gonna have to put it in, maybe a bit of a controversial opinion. I'm gonna put it in the B tier. I just think they're a bit plain. I don't know, there's something about them that doesn't really appeal to me. Pears. Perhaps the plainest of the fruits, and I don't know, anytime I see these I just feel really bored of them. They're not they're not too great or special or anything. I mean I love the render for them in New Horizons, like I love how it has little like spots on it like real pears do. But the way they look in all the other games, meh. I'm gonna have to put it in the C tier. Kind of appropriate because it's a green tier. Not really a negative ranking either, you know, I still like the pears, but putting them in, in any higher would be wrong. Cherries. Also one of my favorite, probably my favorite of the native fruits. Do they belong in their S tier though? I'm gonna say no. I'm gonna say they belong in the A tier along with these. I can't really say they're any better than oranges or apples. I don't think that would be fair. So not quite an S tier fruit for me. Next we have the bananas. <laughs> and, hmm. I really like them, they're a nice addition, they were good to see in Animal Crossing New Leaf. Are they really that special or interesting though? That's what I have to ask. I think they belong in the... Hmm, I'm gonna say the C tier. Now my reasoning for that is, they're cool, they're nice, but they don't really excite me or anything and you barely ever see them in the games, so they're nothing really special to me. Coconuts. Coconuts aren't the most nice looking fruit, but if we're talking about utility, coconuts were, you know, really cool to get in the older games, especially in the GameCube version where you had to go to the island to get them. So I'm gonna have to put them in the B tier. I don't think they're any better than, say, peaches. I think that would be an unfair evaluation. But the coconuts have served a good purpose, and I really like the palm trees that they have. The durian. Perhaps, not maybe the ugliest fruit in Animal Crossing. Then again, I don't know. <sighs> It's gonna have to be a D tier for me. I really don't like this fruit. I don't think it looks nice, and it's just kind of pointless in my eyes. I'm not a big fan. To be honest, I'm not a massive fan of any of these fruits <laughs> um, that you can get from like the island in New Leaf. The lychee, same situation. I just, but is it worse than, you know, I think it belongs in the C tier. I think the C tier is a fair ranking for the lychee. They're kind of cool, but at the same time, they just kind of look like cherries to me. When I first saw them, I thought they were just a special kind of cherry. Not really my favorite. Mangoes, a fruit that I really love, but in Animal Crossing, eh, I don't know if they look that good. Gonna have to go with the C tier. I can't, I can't sit here and say they're better than, let's say, pears, you know? They're good, but not better than pears. Lemons, now, okay. I did say I didn't really like any of these fruits, but this one I actually do like quite a bit. I love the design. The color scheme works really, really well for this one. And lemon trees are just kind of nice to have, you know? So I think I'm gonna have to put this one in the B tier. I really like uh, lemons, big fan of them. I mean, they're very sour and I like sour things, so yeah. Persimmon. Persimmons are really cool. They do kind of look like oranges, but the fact that you can only get them from the final upgrade of Tom Nook's store makes them very special and unique. And I don't know, I just, I like them a lot. I'm gonna have to put them in the A tier. Hmm, actually, you know what, let me think about this. Let me think about this very strongly. I'm gonna have to, mm, I'm gonna put them in the B tier, okay? Because just thinking relative to the fruits in here, like I can't say the persimmon is better than the peach. I, I couldn't sit here and say that. 
Yeah, definitely. Okay, they're going in the B tier. I think the B tier is a fair ranking. I like them a lot. To make it very clear, like, when stuff is in the B tier, that doesn't mean I dislike it, because I know these rankings can be kind of confusing sometimes, but the B tier is a very positive tier. It's just saying that the S tier is the absolute, like, godly tier, you know? Okay. Bamboo. Apparently this is a fruit. <laughs> its design is, is not good. The uniqueness of the tree, however, makes it better than the durian, so I'm going to put it in the C tier. I mean, they kind of get everywhere, but yeah. So now we're on to the big boys. The perfect fruit. The very special fruits in Animal Crossing. Perfect cherries. S tier. I love cherries, and these just look so tasty. They remind me of, like, candy in a way. They look so nice. I'm a massive, massive fan of the perfect cherries. Perfect oranges. Hmm. Design-wise, they're very unique. The rest of these don't have any different, like, they're not shaped differently, but the perfect oranges are shaped differently, which I really like. But at the same time, I don't know if I really like the way they're shaped. I think A tier is a fair ranking for the perfect orange. I'm giving it extra points just because it does have a more unique design, but I don't really love it very much. Perfect pears. Again, I think the pears are pretty boring, and even though these ones are golden, which is kind of cool, they don't really redeem the pear that much for me. I'm going to put it in the B tier. It's obviously better than the regular pear in the C tier, but not quite better than any of these other fruits. Perfect peaches. Now, even though this one is down in the B tier, I think the perfect peach is great. It's golden. It's shiny. It belongs in the S tier. Of course it does. It's really, really great. Next. And finally, we have the perfect apple. Now, even though I wish this was a green apple, which would have been great, I love this one. I love this one. This might be my favorite one. This or the perfect cherry might be my favorite one in Animal Crossing. It's so good. It looks like a candy apple, like a toffee apple, I guess you'd call it. Um, you know, the ones you sort of get from fun fairs and stuff. And I love that so much about this one. It has to go in the S tier. It's such a special looking fruit. And I think that will be my ranking for all of these different fruits. There's none placed in the F or E tiers. Only one place in the D tier. So pretty much everything is, is quite a positive ranking here. I think maybe some of my rankings could change. But I'm pretty happy with how these have gone so far. If you guys want to help support the channel, consider clicking the join button down below to become a member of the Bob's Gang. You can get a bunch of really cool perks for doing so. Thank you guys for watching that video. It actually went on a lot longer than I thought, but it was fun to rank all the fruits. You know, it's a request that I've had a bunch of different times. And um, yeah, it's definitely exciting to do, I guess. So if you enjoyed, be sure to leave a like and of course subscribe for even more Animal Crossing content.